Good afternoon and welcome back into this new More Weather Forecast video. My name is Becky Moore and I'm back here in the weather studio for a new video, one we really have never done before. This is going to be a, your October forecast. We're going to start doing these monthly forecasts as we head later into this fall and into the winter and hopefully all year round, getting you prepared for what to expect in the upcoming month. And of course, this one's going to be our, for October since we are only in the first days of October. So let's get straight into the forecast, looking at the climate prediction centers temperature outlook for the entire United States and as we head into the west that's where it's going to be significantly warmer than average and we're also going to be dealing with warmer than average temperatures as we head down into central and southern Florida and into New England as well that area that does not have any color however is going to be about average about what you would expect for this time of the year for your October now the precipitation outlook we're also going to be have drier than average conditions as we head into the west as far east as Missouri and as far west as Utah going into northern Texas as well throughout much of the plains again that's where it's going to be dry and um, we're going to have those warmer than average temperatures as well and then again into Florida into the southeast that's where it's going to be rainier than average and again warmer than average as we head down into central and southern Florida as well I do expect a lot of rain this October um, there in Florida and throughout parts of the deep south really into the Carolinas down through Georgia as well. So right now we are in an Enzo neutral weather pattern. This graphic from the Weather Channel does show what that pattern does normally look like this time of the year. Through winter, we do get that colder air as we head into um, the Great Lakes region down to the Midwest, Ohio Valley, and New England. And this is all going to make sense as I put our next graphic, our last graphic up here in a second. That subtropical jet actually does come up into the southeast, bring wet at, wetter conditions as we head into the southeast and again that's why we're going to see that in florida and then also warmer than average conditions and what did i just show you those warmer than average conditions in the west so this does make sense this is why um i did those graphics are like how they are because we are in that enzo neutral pattern and as you just saw with those graphics this kind of does correlate with um what the pattern usually looks like for this time of the year as we head into winter. And then lastly, the graphic like you, likely you've been looking for is the October forecast graphic from More Weather. This is my More Weather official uh, forecast for your October. Rainy conditions are expected in the Pacific Northwest throughout much of the West into the Southwest all the way through um, Texas. That's where we're expecting warmer than average conditions up through the northern half of the country down into the mid-Atlantic and Midwest Ohio Valley region as well. Frequent shots of cool air are expected. We also are going to see that active storm track from Minnesota all the way through Ohio as we get those storms going through southern Canada, likely bringing rain into that red region, cooler than average temperatures into New England, around average into much of the southeast, and then those rainier conditions into Florida. So that about wraps up this October forecast. I hope this helps you planning for your October. Again, I'm going to have this up on my Twitter, so make sure you go follow me on Twitter. Um, make sure you subscribe as well. Have a great rest of your day. Have a great October. Stay prepared out there, and I will see you soon with more weather.